we going, Maggie? Do you know where we're going? What are we gonna go do? Where's the boys? They're in the truck. They're, yep, they're in the truck. They're in the truck. We are going to go get hay. We're, I love hay season. Do you guys like hay season? I know it's hot. It's like, well, it says it's 88 right now. I don't think it's that. I think it's hot. I think it's hotter than 88. But where we're going, it'll definitely be hotter than 88 because that's a little bit more south. 98. Not too far. Not too far. 98. Nine, no, 88 right now. Still almost 90 degrees. It's hot. Hay season equals crickets, grasshoppers, and heat here for sure. But I'm super excited. We like to support a local farmer that cuts hay in an area that is being um, threatened by development. And I'm excited to be able to support her and support, well, their family. And um, it's nice hay. We like to feed high quality alfalfa to our goats and then later we'll get some more straw. So this year we're not quite doubling, but we're getting quite a bit. So we worked hard on cleaning out the shop and uh, we're going to... kid we had three guys two working bales one on each side of the trailer Honey. and then the driver what I want to be on this side of it okay so start turning over that way a little bit because I'm trying to fill in on this side where it's weird and then we had one person on the trailer stacking sometimes more than one person and then um, and then the driver just never stopped we just kept going um, I learned that's how I learned how to drive but we didn't have automatics. We had to drive stick. I learned how to drive. Well, technically it wasn't a hay truck. It was the poop truck. We spread the manure through the um, fields. <laughs> you know, not everyone can say that's how they learned how to drive. I can. It's doing good though. Back there.
a couple ton. I know you big timer hay farmers and all that. You're used to seeing a lot more, but this will see us through for our goats mostly um, through the winter. We're hoping um, we haven't actually had this many goats, but we're still hoping to downsize. So if anybody wants a goat, you know where to find one.